Well, I thought that after BTS confirmed their enlistment, there would be no more controversy surrounding that issue, but no, because Jin just got terribly criticized when making a joke regarding his enlistment. So everyone knows Jin's birthday is coming close. To remind Jin, an army asked him on Weverse if he was excited about the day. To everyone's surprise, the male idol immediately answered he wasn't excited about it as he will enlist in the military in the frontline base. Based on his reply, it could mean that Jin would be deployed close to the border in the northern part of South Korea around the Korean demilitarized zone, where enlisters will likely deal with extreme cold weather with no hot water, and there are snowstorms happening frequently. Since Jin will enlist in the winter, many armies are really worried for his health and mental state. The hashtag take me instead also trended as many fans offered to enlist in place of Jin. Meanwhile, K-netizens are throwing criticism toward the BTS member for his reckless reply on Weverse. The fan was only asking about his birthday, and yet Jin talked about his enlistment which makes it look like he's whining. Some are asking why he is complaining when he isn't the only one who would enlist in the frontline divisions. Besides, it's his duty, he even expressed his desire to enlist sooner in order to serve the country. So what do you think of Jin's reply? Is he complaining about his upcoming military enlistment or is it all just a misunderstanding? Well, what's wrong with YG recently as all the artists just don't renew their contracts? After Big Bang's top, Treasures Bang Yi Dam and Mashiho, recently, Icons Bobby's also reportedly leaving YG Entertainment after his contract expires. So on November 15th, K-Pop Herald reported that an industry insider revealed that Bobby has decided not to renew his contract with YG Entertainment. The exclusive report also claimed that YG is planning on announcing Bobby's future plans very soon. While some doubt this information, a lot of fans felt sad and worried about Icon's future. The group has been slowly dying after BI left because of the drug scandal. Former YG's CEO Jang Yun Suk is even prosecuted to be sentenced three years in jail for allegedly threatening to kill a woman if she dared to reveal BI's scandal. So, if Bobby doesn't continue to accompany Icon, fans are afraid that the day of disbandment is looming large because this is also the seventh year since Icon debuted. Not only that, many netizens also think that since Bobby has got a family now, he may not have time to focus on Icon as much as before. Due to this, he wants to be a solo artist after leaving the group. However, YG denied this rumor and said that there is still time left on Bobby's contract. He and the agency are still discussing the renewal. Hopefully they will meet each other's terms and Icon will be active for another 7 years. Moving on to controversial news today. Everyone knows appearance is very important to a K-pop idol. Yet, it seems like NCT's Mark doesn't think so as he just sparked divided opinions with his unshaved look in a video call with fans. As you know, facial hair is something rarely seen on K-pop idols. Since K-pop fans are not fond of overly manly beauty, and smooth and flawless skin is one of the most important Korean beauty standards. However, in a recent video call with fans, Mark just shocked everyone when appearing with an in-shaven face, where his mustache line is clearly visible. While his unusual look was still praised by many fans who think it's totally normal for a grown man to have mustache, many others expressed their disappointment as they think Mark didn't even bother to groom his visual before having a call with fans. When he first debuted, Mark impressed with his youthful visuals and energy and many fans enjoyed his clean look. So a lot of fans have shown displeasure with Mark's untidy appearance. Some even made rude comments saying since fans are paying to see him, at least do some makeup to cover his facial hair in order to look less offensive. For me, I think netizens and fans should let Mark appear however he wants in whatever way makes him comfortable and confident. As he's grown older, facial hair is a totally normal thing to happen for a man now in his 20s. That's the news for today. Do like, share and subscribe to KBiz Hub if you don't want to miss the juiciest news next time. Bye bye.